Hey guys, I just want to do a quick video on converting your uh, national pipe threaded Blickman fermenter uh, to triclover. So I went ahead and already did the dump uh, hole already with this. It's very easy. Blickman uh, makes the parts for triclover. Uh, you can buy them at Great Fermentations or you can buy them at Adventures in Home Brewing. Any of those uh, part suppliers will have the pieces that you need to convert this thing uh, to try clover it's, and it's not that hard it's actually pretty easy the only hard part about it was that you have to make like a one inch bore um, on the bottom hole like the the hole that the national pipe standard comes with uh, the national pipe standard version of this fermenter comes with I think is like I don't know if it's three quarter inch or what it is but I think it's three quarter inch and so you just need to make it a little bit bigger uh, to one inch actually for the triclover because the triclover uh, needs a bigger hole uh, to fit that that piece that goes in there but once you bore it and you can and I use this thing right here this thing's actually super helpful I use this a lot on uh, drilling any kind of holes into my kettles or um, or in this case fermenters so it worked out really easy it took me about I don't know about 10 minutes to drill the hole just because I was super careful and slow and everything I wanted to make sure I didn't mess up this fermenter um, speaking of messing up the fermenter, I did call Blickman before I did all this to see if this thing was even possible, and, and they said, yes, you can do it. Um, it is possible. Uh, they recommended that I sell my national uh, pipe threaded fermenter to a friend or on eBay or something like that and buy a, buy a new one. Uh, I mean, that's, I mean that's, that's business for you, but I'm, I'm on a budget. And, you know, I don't have time to do all that, so I just converted this over, and it wasn't even that big a deal. So, uh, if you're thinking about doing it, just do it because it's not—it's not that hard. Um, I did take the sample, uh, uh, the sample output right here. I haven't done that yet. I'm going to do it real quickly for you. Uh, you can see that this has got threads on it. I'm actually going to just take this off. That's the threads that it comes with, and Blickman makes this handy dandy exact same part you can see see them it's the exact same part this one's got a little bit of um, a little bit of tape on it still so, uh, uh, Teflon tape uh, but you can see that the parts are exactly the same the parts that go into the arm the sampling arm inside uh, this is just triclover it's a national uh, pipe thread so what's cool about this is I don't even need to drill for this top part and look, it fits right into the sample, um, little sample arm that goes inside. So this is gonna be super easy. No drilling on the top part. I can literally just hook it up there. Boom, done, the part, uh, already converted the top part. Um, this I got at Homebrew Hardware. They have some really, really cool stuff. They got like the best prices I've seen and they're super, super cool stuff like this where it's three quarter inch right here this is an inch and a half uh, triclover right here so I can hook up all my triclover stuff super easy and look they even make this little cute little three quarter inch um, uh, clamp right here so you know I just wanted to show you just how easy it is convert these things. Just down there. Look, it's ready to go. Uh, fully, uh, fully triclovered now. I'm all set. Uh, this wasn't, this wasn't even a big deal. It was super easy. So uh, these fermenters, by the way, are awesome. Blitman really does a great job on these fermenters. So if you're kind of thinking about it, just do it because it's changing by uh, brewing. It's made it so much easier. So, anyhow, um, I hope this helps. Take care.